Yo, what's up guys? I want to give a quick shout out to EA Sports for paying for my trip down to Orlando to allow me to capture some of this early Madden 17 footage you guys are seeing right now. We got more Mutt 17 in the building and our opponent is K Spade. Spade's been one of my favorite YouTubers for a while now doing Madden, doing 2K and it was great to get a game against him. This is the first time we were able to play. He's got Cam Newton at the quarterback position rolling out but he's got nowhere to go except to get sacked by Khalil Mack, second down and long, Eric Berry. Oh, Spay, don't put your hands in the cookie jar. Promise you it won't work out too well as you guys see we're going downfield in the first play. Ooh, Julio Jones almost took us right to a goal line situation. We have a nice offense, John Brown, Julio, you see Brown right there. Odell Beckham Jr. in the slot, Todd Gurley at the backfield, and Russell Wilson leading the way, who overthrows that pass. Probably good overthrow though, because Julio was pretty covered. He's got to see second now. We also have Antonio Gates at the tight end spot. He's fighting, trying to get yardage, but it's going to bring up a third down and long nonetheless. Odell with the catch. Ooh, he paid the price for that one. The Honey Badger laying the boom, but next play, Julio Jones in the back of the end zone scores the game's first point. Great throw by Russell, throwing it over his user where only Julio Jones can get it. And of course, of course Jones is able to come down with the footwork right there as he throws it to AJ Green. Spade's got a lot of weapons to throw the ball to as well as Duke Johnson. I'm not really sure he's one of those Dukes on the team because Spade is a Miami Hurricanes fan and Duke Johnson, former Miami Hurricane, who gets the catch right there. He does have Cam, but he also has Julio Jones. You guys see he's going downfield from right here. AJ Green, you guys saw is Julio Burns, our defense right there getting a step. Now he's in the red zone. Cam throws an interception. Sean Lee snags that one. That was just an overthrow by Cam. A bad break. First spade because he had a position to score at least some points on that drive as Russell Wilson throws that one out of bounds. I want to point out while you guys are seeing this, this is not the final version of Madden Ultimate Team that we guys are uh, we played right here. Is Odell gets the catch on third down once again. Some of the card arts and the overalls and stuff like that might not be final versions. So just keep that in mind as you guys are watching as Russell Wilson almost overthrew us into an interception, just like the way Cam did for him. Thankfully, it sailed far from everyone. That would have been nice if we hit John Brown. As you guys see another third down. Down and long and another conversion to Todd Gurley this time. Spades got us right where he wants us, but we are just living the fight another day. But on first and second down, we have to get better because there's only so many third downs we can convert. But it looks like we have to convert one more. This time a third down and seven. Wilson with the ball in his hands again. Oh, this is what I said. We can't do it every single time, especially since the pass rush can answer. But we're going for it on fourth. And oh, that's KJ Wright. Or, um, Kendall. What am I saying? KJ Wright's the linebacker right there that's Kendall of the Titans and that's OBJ of the Giants hitting the whip for the touchdown get him Odell and we double the lead right there he burnt the man coverage and um, they will convert that fourth down right there one for it because I didn't feel good about the field goal as you guys see recovering the receiver oh but he just climbs the invisible ladder and snags that one over Barry I thought we had our second pick right there I was about to give Spade another speech about the cookie jar but um we'll have to wait on that one and hopefully save it for later oh we could keep to leave forget the cookie jar he's just straight up snagging whatever pigskins in the area that's an interception and we have a chance to continue adding to the lead and potentially make this one a blowout. Wilson throwing the ball well all game long. Continuing. Kendall right with the catch to the nine yard line. Right before halftime. We didn't call a timeout. We ran hurry up. We look for Odell. It is dropped incomplete. Nine seconds left. Trying to punch it in for six. Green pass. OBJ running. Got it. Odell's second TD of the game. Look at him go. Odell's putting on a show and Spade can only watch as his team is down a lot. Heading in to halftime right here. For Spade, a couple of bad breaks that a keep to lead pick. Not on the same page as receiver. Um, came over through the one earlier. You see right before halftime, he's lobbing it up and it's not even caught by Julio Jones. And we get ball coming out of half. As if it wasn't bad enough as you see OBJ returning to kick. I mentioned it before, but a pro tip is you guys see I actually get it past the 25 to the 31 yard line right there, but um, I want to think about needing some of those kicks, fair catching it and taking your fair catch to the 25 yard line because the NFL did change the rules this year. Instead of a fair catch, leading the ball going to the 20, it goes to the 25. So yeah, keep that in mind as you guys see we're throwing some play action right here and that was a dangerous pass right to Tyron Matthew. It is a turnover on downs, but who knows what would happen if the Honey Badger got the ball in his hands. 
Luckily for Spade, though, at least he gets the ball back. And this is obviously a very important drive. You're down 21-0. You got to do something. You got to show you have a pulse. Because there is one thing to be down 21 points. It's another thing to be down 21 to Goose. As he throws a nice comebacker out there. A keep to leave is not matching up well against Julio Jones right now. We got to make sure we give that man some help as he was looking to take a deep shot. But he makes a smart read. I believe that was the running back out the backfield right there. And almost got the first down next play. Pressure in his face. But Julio Jones continuing to answer the bell. A nice 11 for 15 passing day. But it doesn't matter. You have zero points. You got to cap this off with something. As you guys see Duke Johnson trying to find some rushing lanes. Not too many lanes to be found. Big third down. And that is juggled and incomplete. Fourth down. Got to go for it here. Down a lot in the flat. Didn't think Spade would see him. But I was Jordan Reed in the shadows getting the first down near the red zone. Newton looking to take it to the end zone. Trying to leave the pocket. Oh, he's wrapped up. Aaron Donald brings him down. Cam is not able to leave the pocket, and that's great for us. We got to limit Cam to be a passer so we can force him into a couple of mistakes. Like third down with the pressure. Just got to throw it out of bounds. There's not much else you could do. And on fourth down, field goals don't really do much. So Spade's going to go for it here. Take a shot for the end zone. And he's got his man, AJ Green. Just so it looked like he was down and out. Spade showing fight. He's not giving up. He's far from done right here. He feels like the game just started. So we got to make sure we take away his confidence by getting a couple of first downs. Look at Todd Gurley. Just rock that man down to the ground. Power backs this year, I feel like, at least in the beginning of the year, if you're trying to get used to the new ball carrier moves, are the way to go. Guys like Gurley, guys like AP, even like a Thomas Rawls kind of guy. Are the kind of guys you want to work with because those guys can just knock people over. As you guys see Odell Beckham Jr. getting the catch on the outside. And this game, we just were damn near perfect. As you guys see Odell Beckham Jr. catching the ball right there. Not too many mistakes. And remember, we did make a mis mistake. Um, defense didn't really make us pay for it right there. As you guys see, we get the first down. Could have been a closer game. I don't think the score really indicates how close of a game this was because it did feel closer than that. As you guys see Russell Wilson looking to go for the end zone, but we end up getting sacked right there. Just trying to put up some more points on the board right here. Just want to make sure we don't throw an interception. That's the biggest thing. But third down and 18. Check this out. Oh, that could have been a game changer. That could have been a potential pick six. We looked for John Brown. We definitely didn't get him. Thankful we got a field goal out of that drive because it was a little bit dicey. We're going to skip the rest of the plays in this game because as you guys can tell, that field goal definitely iced the game up. That last incompletion is going to end it. Cam with four interceptions was definitely the story of the game, and that's going to do it. Uh, shout out to Case Spade. This was definitely a good game. You guys want to see his channel? That link will be in the description. You guys want to see more Madden 17? All you got to do is hit that like button. We're bringing it back. You want to subscribe to see some more? Definitely do that. And until then, I'll catch you guys next time.